Okay, so continuing on with our sequence of play, after we've completed our node resolution, that's when you're going to do your event check phase. Now, something you do need to keep in mind is if a node is marked with an event complete, as you've already completed the event on that very specific node, you will skip this step. You will only complete an event for a specific node once for each one of your games. So if this node that we're on had already had its event completed, we would simply skip the event check phase. Now, it's very simple to handle your event check phase. If we take the node that we're on here as an example, looking at our event string, which again is located in the top left of the node card itself, we see for this node, it is a five plus slash A. That means that you will do a random number generation, and if it's a five or higher, then the A event is going to take place. And there are multiple different events that can possibly take place. All of your A, B, and C events are all going to be combat events that will be located on your enemy sheet. And then occasionally you will have special events or maybe mission specific events, and you'll find details of those, again, located on your mission map itself or located in the mission example. So as an example, if we did this event check and generated a number five or higher, we would have an A event, which we would look at on our enemy sheet under the class A. And for that, that would be a combat event, which we're gonna cover a little bit later on. But the short version is we would do a random number generation, which would tell us how many and what types of enemies that we would be fighting for this event. After completing your event check, that's when you just move on to your end turn phase, which is really simple. You're either going to take and repeat the steps of the operation phase itself, or if the game has come to its conclusion, the game's going to end, or you do have the possibility of aborting the mission. But again, that's going to take place in a campaign mission, which we'll cover a little bit later on.